Hey guys, this is Sachin Gupta and this is my guide to change. Achieved, it's only because of consistency, right? How exactly I become consistent? Just kept on going one day at a time. And then in maybe three or four months time, I started enjoying that thing actually. And that become a part of my life. Like for example, uh, today, my latest consistency in last one and a half year is my meditation actually, right? I was thinking that I cannot sit at one place without any movement for more than two minutes actually, right? But I started doing that meditation one day at a time maybe for 5 minutes, then 10 minutes, then 15 minutes, then 20 minutes. Today, I can do that for one hour effortlessly actually. Right? Now, there are so many things I'm consistent at from last so many years, whether it is my workout, my diet, my uh, activities, business activities, my meditation, my prayers, everything one by one, but never started all together. One by one, one by one. And now the subconscious mind started believing completely that this guy decides something and he does it actually. So also subconscious mind helps me achieving that, right? So that's my that's my tip for people actually who want to be consistent, right? So comfort zone comes only when you are actually carrying the old belief system where you're coming from and you reach somewhere and you feel it is a destination actually, right? But rather than thinking about where you're coming from, okay, we have to keep thinking where I can reach from here. What is a possibility? There's only one life. Why not taking out the best potential from ourselves actually, right? And that's my mantra for not falling into a comfort zone. And then it become a game then. It become, it become like a like a addiction that you want to break your own records every now and then, right? And you never fall into comfort zone. Comfort zone is like an inertia. Inertia actually deteriorates a person, right? The only mantra for not falling into inertia zone is always have a next goal. Always see the possibility where you can go from here actually, right? And just gun for it. That's it. Never look at people who are behind you, right? Because once you look at people behind you, you always feel, oh, I'm ahead of them actually, right? So I never competed with anybody. Because if I compete with somebody who's going too fast, I will feel demotivated. Okay. If I compete with somebody who's behind me, who's too slow, I'll feel complacent actually. Right? So why not having my own benchmarks and actually figure out what is possible for me? Let's go for it. Right. And that's how exactly I push myself out of comfort zone all the time. But what is more important in this business is what you become in the process of reaching there. Right. right? Because you change as a person completely. So the person who I used to be when I started the business, I'm not the same person. I'm not the same person if I compare myself two years before actually. Right? And the two biggest change which I see in myself is one is being consistent. Consistently disciplined rather I should say. right. And second is never fall into a comfort zone. These are the only two things which help me to change on other parameter. Right? Because if I'm complacent, I will never change. Because change is painful. right? So I ensure that I should never become a complacent. If I'm not consistent and disciplined, even if I know where to change, I'll not be able to change. Right? So these are the two things which are catalyst in other changes which I got in my life. So guys, be the change. Find out those two things actually, which can help you to actually grow and increase the holding capacity. Right?